Let's learn about CLI routing and VLAN configuration command for Cisco devices in Cisco Packet Tracer. IP root network number, network mask, IP address, interface, sets a static route in the IP routing table. Router RIP enables a routing information protocol, RIP routing process, which places you in router configuration mode. Network IP address. In router configuration mode, associates a network with our IP routing process. Version 2. In router configuration mode, configures the software to receive and send only rep version 2 packets. No auto summary. In router configuration mode, disables automatic summarization. Default information originate. In router configuration mode, generates a default route into rep. Passive interface interface. In router configuration mode, sets only that interface to passive rep mode. In passive rep mode, rep routing updates are accepted by, but not sent out of, the specified interface. Show IP rep database. Displays, the contents of the rep routing database. IPNAT, inside, outside. An interface configuration mode, command to designate that traffic, originating from or destined, for the interface is subject to NAT. IP NAT inside source, list access list number, access list name, interface type number overload. A configuration mode, command to establish dynamic source translation. Use of the list keyword enables, you to use an ACL to identify the traffic, that will be subject to NAT. The overload option enables, the router to use one global address, for many local addresses.
IP NAT inside source, static local IP global IP. A configuration mode, command to establish a static translation, between an inside local address, and an inside global address. VLAN. Creates a VLAN, and enters VLAN configuration mode, for further definitions. Switchport Access VLAN Sets the VLAN that the interface belongs to Switchport Drunk Encapsulation.1Q Specifies 802.1Q Encapsulation on the trunk link Switch port access assigns this port to a VLAN. VLAN, VLAN it, name VLAN name. Configures a specific VLAN name, 1 to 32 characters. Switch port mode, access, trunk. Configures the VLAN, membership mode of the port. The access port is set to access unconditionally, and operates as a non-trunking, single VLAN interface that sends, and receives non-encapsulated, non-tagged, frames. An access port can be assigned, to only one VLAN. The trunk port sends, and receives encapsulated, tagged, frames, that identify the VLAN, of origination. A trunk is a point-to-point -point link, between two switches, or between a switch, and a router. Switch port trunk, encapsulation, dot one Q. Sets the trunk characteristics, when the interface is in trunking mode. In this mode, the switch supports simultaneous tagged and untagged traffic on a port. Encapsulation dot one q vlan it a configuration mode command that defines the matching criteria to map 802.1 q frames ingress on an interface to the appropriate service instance hope that the video is useful for network students and engineer subscribe to our channel and click the bell icon to get notification thank you